Hey man, did you hear that the Ashgrass Viola Posse proved the world is flat? What? Yeah man, it's just flat like a piece of paper. You're joking, right? No, I believe it. I've never seen a round earth. Where did, how did, how on earth could they prove that the earth is flat? Is there like, do they have knowledge of how this happened? I don't know. Maybe they sent a viola into space and looked down on us, but I believe them. What if world go- The other is that everybody in this room was taught the story of how Columbus went before Queen Isabella of Spain and he was going to prove to her that the world was...
and that's where everything we is. We just in the middle. Clear. In the middle. And then when it gets to the top, <laughs> my clouds. And then under is the ground. Oh, okay. So you thought. Okay, that's so stupid. <laughs> So, when like Magellan sailed around the world. I don't know who that is. He's the Ferdinand Magellan's first guy to sail around the world. Mm -hmm. Or like when they fly around the world. They're flying in the. So, circle. you didn't realize that like we're standing on top of China right now? Or Australia or whoever the heck's under us? How are we standing on top of China? Because they're on the other side of the world. Yeah, but there's still between sphere. us. I know, but we're standing, you know, technically. Yeah, okay, on top. okay. Like they're the opposite way that we are. Yeah. You, you didn't realize that? No. I thought it was all flat. And in the name this model, the infinite plane, shown here, produces an infinite gravitational field with a down... Exactly what shape is the Earth, if it's flat? A circle or a square? Well, Brittany, to your answer, it's circular. Like a circle. Not a square, but a circle. Like in the UN logo. However, the Earth is not 2D. It is in the shape of a cylinder. Why does that water run off the Earth? Well, there is a vast ice wall all the way around that keeps the water where it is. This explains why you can find a vast plain of ice as you travel southward. The wall is roughly 150 feet high. I was ripped off! Flat Earth Society stole my idea! I am getting no royalties, no TV appearances, and no fame! I really don't know why I'm friends with Brittany. I mean, she's kind of dumb. Obviously, the world is round, and she's the only person I know that thinks it's flat. Other than the rest of the weird Fiola posse. I'm the only voice of sanity around here. Well, contrary to popular belief, the world is actually flat, hence why Brittany is always right. This is Earth. You better be recording this. And this is all the houses. And all the ho and like, if this paper could go like that, like, like this. this, this, this is... No, no, no. Oh. I get what she's talking about. I get it. <laughs> so like right if this if, if it was cut in half, then we would be living okay, if the, okay, if this was half the world and then there's another half on top, this is where it would be. You thought we lived like in the core of the earth? Yeah, like inside of it. <laughs> you thought we lived inside of the earth. What's yeah, like inside of the circle. <laughs> What's on the outside of the circle? See, the clouds! <laughs> okay, so you thought, you thought we were actually inside yeah. a big ball. And, yeah. and everything around and us was were, the outside of the ball. Yeah. And then once you got out, it'd be the stars. So you have to go outside of the ball? Yeah. How, do you get, how do you get to outside of the ball? It just, go, it just go out. Yeah, you like just the, sleep. Yeah. It's like a turbo ball this side. <laughs> okay, I think I kind of get it. You do? Yeah. All right. And this might actually be a good education class to explain to people, okay? So essentially what you're saying is, like, there's all these little people inside this ball, okay? I drew some stick people for you. Okay. You can add, add to it, right? Yeah. Okay. And then the sky is right out here, right? No, the sky is the circle. The sky is up here. Yeah. You know, up here. And then land. Like a snow globe. Yeah. See, like, like a, a snow, snow globe. globe. Yeah. Like, that's what I thought. I get it. Doesn't it doesn't snow in space. Yeah, it does. It, no, it doesn't. On different planets where they have oxygen and water, it snows. Like, never mind. Never mind. She, she just found out the Earth was round. We'll, we'll small steps. Okay, so then... And these are the worms. What do worms have to do with that? <laughs> Hold that up so people can see the worms.
Where, where do the worms come into play into the whole? Because it's the dirt. <laughs> it's earth. It represents earth. Okay, so, so, so what you're saying is it's like we're living in a snow globe. Yeah. Okay. A circular snow globe, like a snow globe inside like, of an ornament. But okay. like we're not on the bottom of it; we're in the middle, middle of it. Right, because the worms are in the bottom. <laughs> that would yeah. still be a one-dimensional Earth. It wouldn't be round. We'd just be like in a spear shaped area. So we still wouldn't be around Earth. So it's wow. really, actually, it would seem like the Earth is almost more of a half circle. No, than no it's a full circle because the worms and flat. the dirt still had to be in there. If you were looking at it from a bird's eye view, it'd the be Earth, flat. It'd be flat. So essentially, she believed the world was flat. So you believe. I world. thought that we all lived on flat world. I didn't. <laughs> I can't do this. Why are you so. You believed the earth was flat. <laughs> okay, we've known for 500 years it's round. Now, just out of curiosity, do you still believe the earth is flat? No! Okay, who okay. told you the earth was flat? No one. You're just well, logically just, just... Yeah. came up with the idea that the earth is flat, I mean, that is to be expected of these people. They give viola a bad name. As a violist, I am extremely concerned about the possible effects the Oshkosh viola posse may have on violists around the world. Violists are already considered to be second-class citizens, and this absurd right-wing conspiracy that the earth is flat only makes matters worse. If this crisis is not stopped, it could spread to the violins, the cellos, the basses, and pretty soon the whole orchestra will be full of lunatics. Hey honey, I heard a rumor going around that a lot of people are saying that the earth is flat. And I hate to break this to you, but the earth is not flat, it's round. Well, Brittany says that the earth is flat. If I catch you hanging out with Brittany, you're grounded for life, you're gonna sit in your room, until you're 21, and I'm going to make you play the tuba. The Ashcast Viola Passage are a bunch of losers. There's a reason why I play violin. Because the earth is round like my head. The earth is not flat. Violins rule. Stop hanging out with that Ashcast Viola Passage. You tell everybody the earth is flat, and it's round. If I catch you again, I'm taking away all your video games and your bicycle, and I'm going to make you dye your hair pink. Honey, isn't it great? that the earth is flat? Then I'm not going on a boat anymore. I don't want to fall off. The aliens will abduct me and I'll get probed. Those guys are a bunch of idiots. I see the movies they rent. They're all terrible. They don't even get it that the earth is round. <laughs> the viola posse they come running around here at hide music and they're constantly talking about how the world is flat they're a bunch of idiots i can't believe it like i gotta deal with this every single day they come here world is flat and they're whining about it 